The information contained in this video is for instructional purposes only. It should not substitute a therapist's clinical judgment or a physician's recommendations. Hello everyone, this is Belen with OT Rehab Ideas. The following video will introduce two creative ways to perform gravity-reduced exercises for the hemiparetic upper extremity. Hello everyone, so I have some interesting treatment ideas today. As you know from the evidence, early and intensive practice is very important when recovering from a stroke. So I have put together a couple of things that I think you'll find interesting. The first one is a PVC pipe I just got from Home Depot. And another piece that I guess, I don't know, you can call it an elbow, I guess. And uh, you can use this for gravity reduced exercises, active assist exercises for the upper extremity. So let me demonstrate for you how to use it. So Jill, I'm going to help you with your hand here. And let's just do some uh, shoulder flexion. So just slide it up. You can use some ACE wrap if you need to, to hold the hand in place or even do some hand over hand. The nice thing about it is you can move it at different angles if you're looking for a little bit more abduction or even some uh, weight shifting. Also down. That's it, more shoulder flexion. And we can also do it this way. Okay, so let's go up this. Let's start it. And see if we could do it with the two hands. That's it. Good. These are just some ideas. You can get creative. The patient could be laying down. They don't have to be seated. Do some great ideas to add more practice. Thank you. Here's another thing I like to use. I use the uh, BC board, as you can see, it glides. And we use it for the repetition um, and intensive practice of the upper extremity. And I like it because you can have the patient follow a form direction when they're moving. So the arm is not all over the place and you have more control. So I'll show you how to do it uh, going forward and back for the shoulder flexion. I put a little piece of Dyson so the hand stays put a little bit better. And I can hold it and have the patient come forward and back. You can have this supported on the table or you can just hold it yourself. And again, you can move it in different directions. Okay. And you can even have it rest on the mat and just work on that lateral weight shifting and weight bearing. And those are some interesting ideas that maybe you can try with your patient. Thank you. And now that you have watched this video, we would like to hear from you. We would like for you to test these interventions in your practice and let us know your opinion. And tell us about other ways to use these devices for the rehabilitation of the hemiparetic arm. You can send your responses to otrehabideas at gmail.com.